Are you tired of catching on fire while welding, but you don't want to pay the high cost of the cleaners to start your clothes? Or maybe the cleaners in your area where you're working doesn't starch very good, or maybe they don't put enough starch in your jeans or whatever. If that's you, stick around because I'm fixing to show you a very quick and efficient way to start your clothes right at home. I'm Austin Ross. I've been pipeline welding for six years now, and I love my starch. Comment starch in the comments below if you love starch. I've been wearing starch since long before I started welding. I like it. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel fresh, presentable, clean. It just makes me feel good, but most importantly, it keeps me from catching on fire. That's what I love about it. And I hate to say it, but a lot of places I end up, they just don't do it like they do back home. So I've come to find different ways to starch my own clothes, and I'm fixing to show you guys how to do the same. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications when I post a new video every Friday. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, so the things you're gonna need are a spray bottle. I would suggest this kind of spray bottle. And this is just your typical weed sprayer, but it's going to be a lot easier on your hand because you don't have to constantly pull that lever like on your uh, like on your normal squirt bottle. You just pour the stay flow, straight stay flow, no water added. I just use straight stay flow into this, pump this up, pressure, and then just go to spraying. So spray bottle, lots of stay flow. That's what I use is stay flow. And then uh, I use these two different kinds of hangers. I use these to hang my pants and then just a normal hanger to hang my shirts. Uh, I like these swivel heads for just a lot easier to hang stuff up. I'll show you guys that here in a minute. Next is the press. This here is a Steamfast brand. This is the only brand of press I've ever had. It's $160 on Amazon right now. Less than $200 you can get into a press. The nice thing about a press is it is literally, I would say, four to five times faster using this press to press pants and shirts as it is using a hand iron. And if you don't believe me, go watch this dreadful, agonizing video of this dude hand ironing his welding shirt. Now, you're not going to get as sharp as creases as, as like I prefer with this press. You'll still get creases, but it's just not as, it's not as detailed. You know, you can't get in as detailed areas, you know, to, to get them lines and real tight together to press, but it definitely works real good for work clothes. And that's mostly what I care about is uh, work clothes and working 60 hours a week, you don't have very much time to press clothes anyway. So this is 10 times faster and you've got your clothes starched. And that's the most important part to me is just having starch so I don't catch on fire. This is way faster, but you can use a hand iron if you are looking to get more precise creases. Now you can either hang your clothes outside if it's a good weather, if you have a place to hang them, or uh, like I'm gonna show you here today, I'm gonna do it right inside. I just got me a curtain rod that I hung across here and you see how I hung these pants. I like to hang them like this because it's easier to spray down. I'm gonna spray them and then flip it around. That's why I like that swivel head. You ain't gotta do anything but turn that swivel head and then just spray them. You get more surface area like this without having to move anything. You could always hang them where the crease, you know, is like the other way, but then you're gonna have to lift up your pants and stuff to spray them, and this way you don't ever have to hardly touch your pants. You just spray top to bottom, turn it around, and spray. Let it dry overnight at least. You can let it dry more if you want, and then press. Press away. <laughs> them the next evening. Pants are dry, stiffer and board. Now they're not too bad, but they're perfect. Fire the old press up, fix and pour some water. And this deal here, because whenever you push this button, steam comes out of these holes right here. And that helps, you know, kind of moisten this since it's dry now, so it can get a good, good press. So here we go, let's press these pants. I usually start with the bottom of the legs and just join these two seams. And just like so. I 
I would say pants are definitely faster than shirts. Either way, this press is way faster than a hand iron. I mean, look at that. You can see that it's like, it's kind of a thicker crease. It's not like paper thin right here, but it's still, it's still got starch in it and a little bitty line, just like so. there's both my pant legs. A lot of times I'll stop with that if I'm not too worried about it or if I'm in a hurry, but sometimes I will go ahead and press the top here just just if I'm feeling feeling froggy and got the time. One pair of pants starched and pressed. Pressed in less than 10 minutes. You gotta love it. And real quick, I'll go ahead and show you guys a couple of things. I normally take this collar, put it in like this, and then I'll fold it back around like that. And there you have the collar. It's nice and pressed. You know, sometimes your collar will be curling and stuff, especially on them Wrangler shirts. It drives me crazy, I don't know about y'all, but put a little starch in it and press it three times and you've got a nice straight collar. And then, uh, like I said, the shirts take a little bit longer, but after I do the collar, I normally do the back of it and I shove it all the way in here, like so. And then I just keep pulling it out, you know, until I get to the bottom. And then I do my sleeves. I love it. I love this press. It's changed my world. I mean, it still takes time, but not near as much time as a hand iron. And you got starch in your clothes. You don't have to worry about catching on fire. And don't have to pay the $8, $10 for a pair of pants and the $5 for a shirt every time you go to the cleaner. So there you all have it. Easy, right? We'll put a link in the description so you can go get your own press and press your own clothes right at home. Subscribe for more videos like this one or the Pipeline lifestyle in general. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a great weekend and a Merry Christmas. And remember, learn something every day. We will see you next Friday.